And we're back, everyone. We are the overachievers, and that's what we're doing. We're gonna overachieve some shit. <laughs> I can't believe they died. Those guys are still dead. If you don't believe it, you've seen how to do it, so... You've seen how to let them kill themselves. You can recreate it, and I guarantee you they will not move. For only 1990... Okay, so... Is that last homeless guy the very Yes, the one okay. in the green behind Barrett right now, in front of where Tifa is currently standing, is a slightly item giver. two clouds left, just so we have everyone's point of view. Yes, yes. Um, just so you guys know, uh, we just tried to record this and it failed and my computer exploded. So we're going again. This time I'm not gonna mess up because I totally screwed up. And then again, we want to get to the grinding spot, so we do, and that's not too far ahead. So, well, I guess like, should I purposely mess up or should I try and get through the whole train? Well, you want to get at least both items, right? Well, yeah, There's only two. You only need to get to the third train. You don't even really need to get to the third train. You can fuck it up on the second train. There's only two items to get once you're on the train. If you're, yes. If you're really concerned with getting everything, there's two items, so it's not, and it's not like you're going to miss out on a weapon for somebody, or right? it's like a potion, or a high potion, like a phoenix now, I think, is all you get. I thought it was a phoenix now. So, it's not a big deal. I, I just haven't successfully done it, so I kind of feel obligated to successfully do it. Whatever happens, happens. We're going to be doing a grinding session here coming up in about 10 minutes anyway. Speaking of minutes, how's your pizza? My pizza should be done in now. And you heard it here first, folks. Just pizza should be done. Now. I'm going to go check my pizza while Jed tells you about the train. This is a train. It's moving approximately 98 miles an hour. Um, I lied. But, no, um... Yeah, so we're just going to be doing this, and then uh, we're going to be going back to one of mine and Justin's personal favorite grinding spots. It's how we work on limit breaks uh, prior to the party getting split up. Spoiler, the party gets split up uh, in the near future. So, yeah, we're just letting you know. Three minutes, we're jumping off this train. Jesus, come over here. I'm here. I'm here. Don't worry. I have pizza. <laughs> it is hot, and I can't eat it yet. But I have it. <laughs> Alright, what I miss? Um, nothing. Awesome. Oh, here it is. Woop, 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 woop. <laughs> woop, woop. Whoa, still too hot. Don't eat it. You made both? I did make two. Okay. You can have some. No, I don't want it. It's supreme. But you can still have some. I'm very picky. But you can still have some. I, I know I can. I'm not going to. You should eat some vegetables. You should eat some vegetables. I will eat some vegetables. You're clearly not eating vegetables. Well, once it cools down, I will eat some vegetables. Alright. So just so you guys know, the train's alarm is going off. And, and we does not need vegetables. I died on 20 vegetables. Oh, talk to the guy in the back. Bam. Item one. Now Please you stop. run forward. And then you run all the way to the front of the train after the dialogue, which is pointless. Don't worry about it. Blah, 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 blah. And that guy. Who just just passed. Bam. Item. Yes. You answer the first option. Boom, high potion. That is all the items you can get on the train. Sure. I am positive. So, nothing too exciting. Just so take a break, and then you can go up. They give you a freebie, pretty much, because Jesse knocks that guy out. And she's really angry. I'm not sure about what. Ah. Jed wants to go to the front because he's never done it before. And, uh. I don't know. Something. Uh, I'm but, done. here we go, going to the front of the train. This is the last car. Why are you narrating everything I'm doing? 
because Joe's psycho and we should be jumping off the train about 10 seconds ago. Wasting time, wasting time. My pizza's hot. It's gonna stop holding it. Ow. Yeah, okay, let me go. Ouch. Wow. Sure you don't want it? I'm sure I don't want it. Thank you very much. It's gonna be good. There's two of them. I know there's two of them. I don't want any. Okay. Alcohol or no alcohol, I don't like peppers. <laughs> they're not really peppers. Okay, they're flash frozen peppers. Yeah, so they're like peppers. Hurry up and don't train. We know what's gonna happen. Yes, we can't go any further. Spiky hair. Boom. <laughs> That's pretty much the conversation. Alright, so maybe explain to them what well, we're oh, gonna do. You want me to do it because last time you gave like a five minute monologue on what well, we're gonna do. Well, we still have six minutes, but now that you went to the end of the train... We have a lot longer to walk. Yeah, you have to run all, all the way back. And it's this way, right? Yeah, backwards. I would recommend if you want to do what we're about to do, jump off the second train yeah. after the high potion. Exactly. Um, so I think so far I've made it seem like I've never played this game before because so far you've taught me like three things that I didn't know. Um, I have played this game and I have 100% of this game before. Um, just these little nuances that Justin knows, I I don't. Um, but I am very familiar with what I'm doing. I'm just awesome. You know what I didn't use yet? The all material. I should try that way. You didn't pair your all material? No, I didn't. I'm, I'm doing stuff right now. I'm busy. I'm too busy for all. I should probably play next time. Okay, I offered. I offered and you were like, no, I'm eating pizza. Ooh. Well, I really wanted this pizza. Silk, slow you down. Thanks. Uh-huh. I wasn't aware. I don't understand. How Silk will slow you down. Hey, String Shot and Pokemon slows you down. Yeah, but Silk, it's like the lightest material on Earth. No, but when you're wrapped in it, you get slowed down. No, yeah. I've been wrapped in Silk. I don't want to talk about it right now. No, you've, but when you've been wrapped in Silk, how fast were you able to run? <laughs> okay, I'll admit I didn't try running. See? Then you, you don't know. You At that do. point, I wasn't really concerned about running away. <laughs> What is this? Oh, you should have paired all material. I really should have, because Bolt would just blow them away at this very moment. Oh, they'd all die. But, these guys are good to build, uh, build limits on, too. Because of that. Because of that. Watch it. Bam! Halfway up. I think Tifa's limit break is probably my favorite to do, because it actually requires thought. There's no thought, you press X. No, but it requires timing. Ah, oh, hot pam. <laughs> like hot damn, get it? Hot damn. Bam. Oh, fuck that. Good. Good thing I haven't wasted it. So, anyway, yeah, so there's this grinding spot back here. Um, I said I was going to explain it a minute ago, and I didn't. Um, Scrying spot that Justin and I have always enjoyed. It's um, basically these guards that you just do a dialogue option and then you fight them. Um, and they're really good for raising your limit break. Um, and because the party is going to be split in the near future, it's nice to get some limit breaks up. Um, as we mentioned in previous episodes, we're not going to be... I keep forgetting to prepare this freaking all material. Remind me to do it. Hey. Oh, I want the yes, don't I? There we go. I was getting pizza. Um, yeah. No, so, uh, we're not going to be showing it all on screen, but we will uh, finish out the episode uh, doing the fights, and then we'll, and then we'll cut it uh, when we're done. So, or we won't. I haven't decided yet. I think it's only one more screen away. I think it's six screens 
total. From one end to the other. All materia. I'm doing it. Kinda. Oh wait, I bought equipment that I haven't used yet. What is wrong? Are you serious? Yeah, I'm serious. Wow. Calm yourself, fool. Oh. I always make Tifa my magic user in the beginning. I always do that too. Her and Eris. It's always the girls who are magic users. I don't know why. I honestly don't care about like a nerd blah 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 but whatever. We've got to turn back. Nope. Yeah, if you go forward it's automatic. You're the avalanche. <laughs> I'm really paranoid about this recording now, so I keep checking the time. The first one you get for free. Wait, what do you mean for free? You don't have to interact. Oh, the next one. Now we do? Yeah. I haven't played this game so long. So basically, you fight these guys, and it's always gonna be the same. Look, they're gonna see it in just a minute. Yeah, but you know. <laughs> it's gonna be the same three enemies. All you have to do now is wait while they have like a little dialogue and press X, I think, twice. Or circle in this case. Yeah. And then here they come. You can either run or stay here. You push down, boom, stay here. By the way. And then once you're satisfied with where you're at, or even if you didn't do this, and it really doesn't matter, and next time you guys see us, we'll be continuing on the way to Sector 5 Reactor. Yep. But we're gonna fight. Speech is pretty good. I'm not gonna eat too much. Speech is probably easy. Speech. And you should probably change camera view to fix. Why? <clears throat> Otherwise, it always does that. I think it looks cool when it's rotating. Ah, it's stupid. You have no taste. I have no taste for bad graphics. These graphics are not bad. They're classic. Have you seen the PC graphics? <laughs> Stop complaining about this. <laughs> <laughs> They're really good. Hit Mr. T. E. E. I think his limb break has been there since, like, the guards were. Wow. He actually hit Mr. T. But it didn't move. It didn't look like his it. His limit didn't move at all. Ha <laughs> It did six damage in the back row. Oh, right. And it's a good thing we're saying so much interesting stuff, or else it would be really boring to watch what it is we're doing. You could theoretically sit here if you had your, uh, not battle speed, but active or weight. Oh, yeah. What do they call that? Uh, oh, I can't think of it. Yeah. Anyways, the setting on which the ATV, battle, isn't it? yeah. On what it takes place at, I mean, you could sit, what we have it set on now, it basically. If we don't make a move, the enemy will when their attack bar fills up. You can change it so your character will just sit there until you make a move. Blah blah blah. So I mean you could just sit here, heal yourself and let your limits break you know, let your limits build up, use them, sit there, you, you know. But that's pretty boring. And you get less experience, less money, blah blah blah. So you might as well just fight. Are you telling me or are you telling them? <laughs> I'm telling you, because you're kind of over sitting there. Well, I know. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for Mr. T's limit. Look how close he is. Well, I'm not happen. doing it for experience. I'm doing it for the limit breaks. It's not gonna happen in this fight. Oh, it will. See, look, look how happening this is gonna be. Soon. Yeah, it's Tifa. She's gonna get her seven, second limit break before Mr. T gets first. 
Who's in the back row? Move Mr. G to the front row. Wait. Can we do that? Yeah, we can. Bam! Look how front row he is. See, now he's got a limit. Isn't that weird? In your face, Justin. Phone book. They don't know what that means. <laughs> he got lucky. Oh wow, look. We are totally there. Alright, um, so that was an example of what we're going to be doing for the next, like, million years. Yeah. So, that's it. Um, 